Hello and welcome to Get Fussy Tech Chats. The aim of this format is to deliver a short presentation on our product in five minutes. This presentation is about Get Fussy Topical Solubilizer and how to use them to optimize your skin delivery system. The three main formulation rules to be considered in skin delivery are Number one, drug must be solubilized into the formulation or the vehicle. Number two, when applied, drug must be released from the formulation or the vehicle to partition with the stratum corneum. Number three, drug molecules must diffuse through the stratum corneum either by the permeation into corneal sites or by the diffusion in intercellular lipids. The critical parameters for effective transdermal and topical delivery are solubility of the active in the formulation, but also how the formulation is interacting with the skin. Excipient can help you to reach this target by solubilizing drug, but also by interacting with skin lipid. This is the list of gat solubilizer uh, that uh, we offer for skin delivery. They are all liquid, non-irritant. As you can see, there are different categories of excipient. The two first line correspond to surfactants like Labrazol or Labrafils. And then going down in this uh, table, we have more lipophilic excipient, capriols, pleuroleic, chloroglycol, labrafax, pcols. They are used uh, as a lipophilic solubilizer. And the last line is transcutol P, is a solvent. So all these excipients have been already approved in different medicines. And you have in the last column the market references. The formulation rule number one says that the drug must be in solution in the formulation. To do this, it is important to screen different excipient and solubilizer with your drug. In this slide, you see the results of different uh, drug screening. Uh, four different model drugs have been tested with different excipients. So all these excipients have been tested in a binary mixture. And you see we can rank the ability of the excipient to solubilize a drug. In these examples, we can see that transcutol P is always the first excipient that solubilizes the highest amount of drug. It is followed generally by uh, Capriol 90, Labrazol, or Pleurololeic. Uh, so it's interesting to see that for different uh, chemical drugs, we got the same results. Transcutol P merits a special attention in this presentation for its remarkable solubilizing properties and its safety profile. It has been used in various topical dosage forms for decades and is listed in the IIAD with level of use up to 50% in topical gel. Also, you can find a white paper called Efficient Skin Delivery Non-Compromise with Transcutol. When your formulation rule number one is completed, you have to think about the two other formulation rules, number two and number three, partition diffusivity. Drug must leave the formulation to go into the stratum corneum. Once drug reaches the first layer of the stratum corneum, it has to diffuse through it. To do this, you can also select different excipients. If you want to increase drug partition into the stratum corneum, you need to increase drug solubility in the stratum corneum. To do this, you need to have specific excipients in your formulation that are able to penetrate the skin. This excipient can drag the drug into the stratum corneum. 
This is a case for transcutal P, PEG 400 or propionyl glycol. They do a pull effect. It means that they, they can help the drug to penetrate the skin. On the other hand, to increase the diffusion of drug in the structural corneum, you need more lipophilic vehicle, such as neuroglycol FCC, capriol PGMC, pyrololin CC497, or IPN. This excipient can interact with the intercellular lipids and then enhance the drug diffusion through the stratum corneum. This is called the push effect using more lipophilic vehicle. So to summarize, make synergies, use a solvent to solubilize the drug in the formulation, such as transcutol P, capriol 90, or lapazole. Use excipients that penetrate the stratum corneum and drag the drug to do the pool effect, like transcutol P and use a more lipophilic excipient that enhance the diffusivity, the push effect, like loroglycol FCC, capriol 90, or pyrololeic CC497. Thank you very much, and see you soon for another tech chat.